Hello, everybody. Happy Tuesday to you, my friends. Happy Tuesday. Still getting set up around here. Hope you're having an amazing day. There we go. There we go. Putting it all together. Hope you guys are doing good tonight. So glad you decided to come over here and play a little bit of tarot with me. We're going to do messages from your ancestors tonight. Pick a deck style. Uh, blessings from your ancestors. I'm still trying to tune into Ramden Mike over here. There we go. Now I can see my chat. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. There we go. Hello, 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 everybody. Glad you're here. Happy Tuesday to you. Happy Tuesday. We're going to do three spreads tonight. I'm going to play with the fun, fun, fun Tinker's Dam. It's Tinker's Dam time. It's Tinker's Dam time. It's Tinker's Dam time. It's a funny name, but an amazing deck. 156 cards in this deck. So we're going to do three different spreads tonight. You choose, of course. I'm going to use the same decks. I'm going to play with the Tinker's Dam. I'm going to play with the Mystic Moon Oracle. See what that has to say as well. And uh, I will probably throw some love cards out too as well. Those are on the desk. And uh, a couple of Major Arcana from the Starman. Somebody say hi to me. So I can see if my chat's working. Everything looks good. Hope your day's going good. Anybody said hi to me yet? Somebody let me know and see if that chat's working. That would help. That would help this evening if we're going to do private readings. Wow. My chat not working? There we go. Hey, everybody. Hey, everybody. Hey, Connor. Thanks for saying hi to me. Hi, Beth. Nice to see you tonight. Keys is in the house. Hi, Keys. Glad you're here. Who's that? Serena. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Hello, 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 my friends. Gonna have some fun tonight. I like playing with the Tinkers Dam. If you want me to pull cards for you after uh, my pick a, pick a card here, messages from the ancestors, it's easy to do. Smash that join button, become a member of Ramblin' Nation. Uh, five different levels. The, the different levels uh, talk about the amount of time that I will spend with you every month with your reading with me. You can get a reading for as little as $6.99. That's the best way. You get it on Wednesday nights and Saturday nights with us over there. Or a one-time $9.99 super chat to take all my payments through... Uh, YouTube right here, uh, that'll get you an 8 to 10 minute read, or all my members, every time you catch me live, be sure and check the uh, super chat area right down there, hit that money button, and see if you have a milestone marker available, if you do, just simply click it, just simply click it, and your name will come up. I'll shout you out. All that kind of fun stuff. All right, all right, all right. Let's do it. Let's play some tarot around here tonight. Uh, somebody else say hi to me. And make sure that I don't know what's going on with my chat tonight. Hope the sound is good. Hope the picture is good. I'm working on my lighting a little bit around here. I like it a little bit dark and all that. Looks nice to me. Hope it looks nice to you. Thank you, Keys. Thank you, Keys, for letting me know that chat's hot. Appreciate you. All right, let's tune in. Let's have some fun tonight. Let's see what Tinker's Dam says. Blessings from your ancestors or messages from your ancestors. We're going to go one, two, and three. You pick. You pick. You know, maybe all three, huh? Maybe all three. Thank you, Beth. Thank you, Beth. Appreciate you so very, very much. Let's tune in. Let's tune in. Hey, Tarot, love team. A bunch of my friends are going to play Tarot with me tonight. We're going to do pick a deck messages or blessings from the ancestors tonight. 
Thank you so very much for it. I want to thank you for clarity, accuracy on my part. Help me see, help me speak what I need. How about my friends, see and hear what they need out of these reads today. Let's take all these amazing pictures from the Tinker's Dam, the Love Cards, the Mystic Moon Oracle, and the Bowie right there, and put together nice, clear, accurate stories, nice, clear, accurate messages from the ancestors for all, for all my friends. Thank you so very much, Source. Cannot do this without you. Appreciate you so very, very much. All right, my lovelies, let's rock and roll. Let's rock and roll. Let's play a little tarot tonight, huh? All right, let's start with a time stamp right here. Hello, everybody. Rambling Mike here, gonna play a little pick a deck with you tonight. Uh, blessings from your ancestors or messages from your ancestors right here. We're gonna do three spreads tonight with the Tinker's Dam. It's 156 cards. I do have some love cards here as well. I will throw out some love cards on it. I'm going to play with the uh, Mystic Moon Oracle as well tonight. And uh, we'll top it off with a couple majors from the uh, Starman 22 Major Arcana right there. And here's going to play with all the same decks. But you choose which deck you're feeling led to. Okay? The first one's going to be the Amethyst. Amethyst is going to be number one tonight. This number two is going to be the beautiful, beautiful turquoise. And number three will be the crystal tonight. So here we go. Here we go. Make your choice right here. And then uh, you will click over to your reading. One, two, or three. So here we go. One. Two. Or three. All right. I will see you at your reading. All right. Fun, 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 fun. Let's do it. I, I like these ancestor reads. I do. I do. I like them a lot. All right. Let's rock and roll. Who's here? Who's here? Who's here? Lupita's here. Hi, Lupita. Nice to see you tonight. Beautiful time. Hello, hello, hello. Nice to see you. Hey, David. <laughs> Dave, it's easy, it's easy to grab a read with me. Smash that join button. You get a read with me every month or $9.99 Super Chat. That'll get you about a 10-minute read. It's pretty easy and pretty reasonably priced, too. You can get a reading for as little as $6.99. I'd be honored to pull you some cards, Dave. All right. Knight Rider's in the house. Hello, Knight Rider. Hello, hello, hello. All right, let me tune in. We focus on group number one, group number one, messages from your ancestors, blessings, blessings from the divine for group number one, group number one, group number one, group number one. Here we go. Woo. All right. I'll be with you in a minute, Connor. Thank you, my friend. All right, let's rock and roll. Hello, group number one. Going to play some tarot with the Tinker's Dam tonight. 156 cards, messages from the ancestors, blessings from the divine, whatever you want to call it right here. I got some love cards. We'll throw out some love cards too as well. Mystic Moon Oracle and a couple of the Starman David Bowie Major Arcana is the top off your spread. Let's rock and roll. Love team, love team. What do we got? What do we got for group number one? Group number one. Messages from the divine. What's this for? Oh. Well, this is a pretty special card for me. Of course, I have my own meanings for this deck. There's a full tarot deck in here, but there's a bunch of extra cards as well. Uh, this is the Sphinx, number one. And uh, this, is the, this is the one that I call the chosen one. You know, many are called, but few are chosen. The, ch the chosen choose to be the chosen. They may have to pay a price that few know much about. Anyway, this is straight from the gods right here. Keeper of the mysteries. Uh, dominance, intelligence, 
Uh, Mysteries of the Collective Unconscious. There you go right there. Look at that. That onk on the third eye. It's like an ancient soul right here. An ancient soul. Look at the peace and the stillness in that card. But yet, uh, what's it say right there? Dominance. Dominance and intelligence. Beautiful, beautiful. Let's go. Let's go. Group number one. Group number one. Highly honored. Highly honored. Here we go. Here we go. Group number one. Group number one. What else are we going to say to them? Oh, what's this about? Damn, two cups came out. Now, I don't know if you're already in something sweet or if they got something planned for you right here, but this is two of cups, you know. Picture time. Picture time showed up. Two of cups showed up. So we're definitely going to pull some love cards. Definitely going to pull some love cards on this one right here. Mm-hmm. Two of cups came out, so that's that's a pretty blessed-looking union. And if you're not in one, eh, get ready, get ready. Let's see what else they say. Let's see what else they say. Group number one. Group number one. Group number one. What do we got? Messages from the divine. What do we got? What's going on around here? Oh, look, this is uh, this is three pinnacles. Now, three pinnacles is a nice card of collaboration. And, you know, look, uh, they're building the, the, is it this couple right here with the blessings of the divine? Uh, building, you know, what's that, the golden city right there? What's I put on this one right here? Uh, great works, aspiration, and application. Oh, that's nice. So if you're already in a union, you know, this is like the blessings of the gods on your union. You guys look like you're building a golden city or something right here. Very nice. Give me more on this, please. Give me more on that. Oh. Well, they just stopped me right here. They, they, they do. This is Eight Pinnacles. Eight Pinnacles is a great money card. <laughs> yeah, I'm reading for a nice couple right here. If you tuned into this one, you know. You know, peace be still, right? Wow. Uh, Eight Pinnacles, what I put on this? Authority. And capability in one's work. Oh, look at that. Three pinnacles right there. Great works with authority and, and capability in that right there. Who? This couple right here. Oh, now I put on there's one word. It says union. Very nice. Group number one. Oh, the favor of the gods. Building a golden city. <laughs> Stacking some coins. Eight pins. Well, well, there we go. There we go. What's that? Oh, it's the lovers. It's the lovers, in case you were... Wow, group number one. <laughs> it's the lovers, darling. Major Arcana. Big Gemini. Choice in future affairs. Look at this future right here. Oh, my goodness, man. Union of Opposites. Very nice, very nice. Uh, choices in future affairs. Ooh, look at this, look at this, man. Three pinnacles, eight pinnacles, two cups, and the lovers. You know, for my sphinx. <laughs> and look at this right here. Look at this right here. It's the star card. It's the star card. Group one, wow. Uh, transcendence. Experiences beyond the normal. In, uh, in the spiritual world and the physical world. Renewal. Hope. Clarity. Wow. The star. The star. So if this isn't, if this isn't, you know, at hand, grab that star right there. Grab that star right there. That's like a promise. This is a promise for somebody. If you're already rocking in that union right there, nothing but the blessings from the gods are on this table. Very, very nice, group one. Let's go a couple more, huh? And then we'll pull some love cards, see what Mystic Moon Oracle has to say. But very nice cards, very nice cards from my Sphinx. Here we go, here we go. Oh, look at this, man. This is the Ace of Pentacles. It's like the whole world in your hand. Who is this power couple right here? Damn, man. This is the Ace of Pentacles. It says, all earthly powers are in your hand. 
creation, stability, security, and grounding. Wow, now that, that's the ace right there. That's the ace that would go to the 10. Oh, and look at love, too. Look at you guys, man. Venus. <laughs> Venus showed up. Uh, sensuality. Immersion in the beauty of this physical world. And the senses. Group number one. That's a nice blessing right there. Somebody grab a hold of that right there. That's nice. That's nice. Nice thing about this, you can come back and watch these regularly. Okay. Let's throw a couple love cards on it, huh? Let's throw a couple love cards on it, huh? Group one. Group one. A couple of love cards. And then we'll throw the Mystic Moon. See what Mystic Moon has to say. Here we go. A couple of love cards. Two cups. Three pinnacles. Eight pinnacles. The lovers. The star. The ace of pinnacles. And Venus. For my sphinx. Love card. Love card. Love card. Ooh, for some of you, it may be some kind of rekindling. Not for everybody. You know what's going on in your world. Some of it's a rekindling right here. A rekindling of a power couple. Beautiful. Beautiful. For such a time as this. Let's go. Let's go. Give me something. Give me something right here. Heart to heart conversation. So nice. So nice, so nice, and attraction. Look at that right there. Attraction. Being in the now, being in the moment, letting the past be in the past, and not putting too much pressure on the future. You know, my past life lovers. My past life lovers. Very nice, very nice. Very nice. Let's see what... Uh, Mystic Moon Oracle has to say. What we got? What we got for my loved ones here? What we got? What we got, love team? Messages from your ancestors. Here we go. Mystic Moon. <laughs> somebody, somebody, somebody's coming home. Somebody's coming home. It's very nice, very nice. Here we go. Yeah, that Ace of Pentacles right there to Venus, to love. The star, the star is a card of healing, hope, and faith for my lovers right there. Oh, looks like you guys are going to build a golden city. That's what it's saying to me. We have an opportunity to. Give me more on this. Group one, group one. Now, if you haven't met anybody, be expecting for somebody to show up. To What's this? I guess it would be like no more settling. No more settling. Here we go. Here we go. Mystic Moon Oracle. Mystic Moon Oracle. Yeah, somebody ain't settling no more. This is this is real. This is a power union right here. Very nice, man. Give me something. Mystic Moon Oracle, please. Group number one. Group number one. Here we go. Oh, You know, what this is talking about is somebody doing the inner work. Look at him. Look at him. Somebody did the inner work. Somebody's coming out of the shadow. They're not ignoring the shadow anymore. Wow. Powerful. Powerful. Oh, yeah. Look. Oh, man. That's... that's the, oh. <laughs> well, for some of you, <laughs> some of you may put put a name on this kind of union right here. Wow, man, for such a time as this, if you can't read that font, it does say the twin flame on it, the twin flame. Very nice, my friends, very nice, huh? For such a time as this, huh? Let's put some of these high vibrational power couples together on this planet. All right, all right, all right, that was fun right there. Give me a major arcana from the star man. What's that about? Oh, that's the high priestess. Wow, did you see that jumping around? That's the high priestess came out right there on this spread. So this is my priestess of the moon. Keeper of the mysteries of the collective unconscious, you know. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. Look at all that green. Look at all that heart shocker right there, okay? And, uh, of course, it's uh, a lot of intuition, psychic abilities, 
definitely a healer right here that I'm reading for. Looks like a heal and a whole bunch around here these days. My high priestess, male or female, right? It's very nice. Uh, I always see the high priestess as somebody that, uh, well, they get to go dance in the sun for a minute. Very nice, very nice, very nice. Give me one more, one more major. Group number one, group number one. Oh, to the Empress. Oh, my goodness, man. Now the Empress is Venus again. Look, look. You got both my Venus cards. You got both my love and abundance cards right here. Uh, and, uh, and uh, well, the, the Empress gets to come up and dance in the sun. She's always birthing something new and creative. And don't get hung up on that twin flame card right there. It doesn't have to be a twin flame union. It's a very, very strong union right here. And for some of you, it is a rekindling. Yeah, death and rebirth. Death and rebirth. Beautiful, beautiful story, man. May the blessings of the gods continue to pour out in your life, group number one. I hope you enjoyed this reading right here. May all your dreams come true, my friends. Love and light. Bye for now. Wow, that was fun, huh? I like these ancestor reads. Let's do another one. Let's do another one. Let me see. I had somebody shout at me, huh? Hey, Jesse Bear, nice to see you tonight. Hi, Mermaid, nice to see you, Mermaid. Usagi, hi, Usagi, nice to see you. Oh, well, absolutely, I like that, Jesse Bear. Absolutely, you can put these kind of readings uh, in, your, in your save list. Uh, you know, we manifest what we think and what we feel and what we believe. That's the facts, Jack. So, you know, watch positive stuff. <laughs> so that's all I do. I watch positive stuff. I ain't got no time for no negative, stupid stuff, man. Life is short. <laughs> yeah, I want to I get what I'm after while I'm here. Anyway, I see somebody shouted at me for a read. Let's get some names on the list right here. Let me see who's been hollering at me while I've been pulling cards. Who's up in here? If you want to read with me tonight, it's easy to get one. Just smash that join button, become a member, choose the level that you want, or like Connor did right there. Hi, Connor. Definitely pulling you some cards tonight. Nice to see you, my friend. Uh, that that nine ninety nine button will get you an eight to ten minute reading, uh, movie thread with major arcanas and clarification on all of that. Thank you, Connor. Looking forward to pulling cards for you tonight, my friend. All right. All right. Or, of course, all my existing members, always check and see if you got a milestone marker available to you. And I will pull you some cards. All right. All right. Who's that? Diana. Hi, Diana. Nice to see you tonight. Welcome, my friend. What we got? 21 in the house. And 23 if you hit that like button. Thank you. Some, somebody out there is magic. <laughs> Can hit that button more than once. Hey, Knight Rider. Nice to see you. Hey, Dave. Nice to see you tonight. Something wonderful. Love your name. Hello, my friend. Hello. Something wonderful. Beautiful name. Okay. Let's do it, group number two. Our turquoise babies. Our turquoise babies. A little sip of water. Okay. Let's shake it up. Let's shake it up. Laura, hi Laura. Nice to see you tonight, my friend. Going to pull you some cards. Who is that? Who's that right there? Oh, here we go. Here we go. Hello, my friends. Hello, hello, hello. All right, all right. Let me get back over here. Thanks, everybody. Okay. Laura D. 
Thank you, Laura. Uh, that's a level two. So is Connor. And who's this right here, man? Crest? Genevieve? I hope I said that right. I'm going to call you Crest. Thank you, my friend. You get a nice full read for that. Thank you for that blessing right there. I'm going to give you a nice full read tonight, my friend. See? E-S-T. I'm going to call you Crest. Quinevine? Very nice. So nice to meet you tonight. Hope I say your name okay. We'll definitely get the reading. Perfect. That That's a, at least a level three right there. Level three read. You get a bunch of oracle cards as well. There's my Sky. What's happening, Sky? So nice to see you tonight, my friend. 18 months. 18 months of membership. Thank you, Sky. Level one. Appreciate you so very, very much. Oh, my Virgo Libra friend. Do your movie spread. Where are we going? I like that. Where are we going? I like that. All right, my lovelies. Thank you, my friends. If you want to grab a read with me, it's easily done. Just smash that join button or $9.99 or dig up your milestone marker. All right. I'm going to focus on group number two right here. I'm going to focus on group number two. Let's shake them up. Tink is damn time, huh? Tink is damn time. Tink is damn time. All right, all right. Oh, it's French. <laughs> well, I'm just an old Southern boy. <laughs> I, I, I'm challenged enough with English half the time. <laughs> anyway, anyway. Anyway, my lovelies. All right, all right, all right. Turquoise group. Yeah, my turquoise group. Yeah, that's a nice chunk of turquoise right there, too. I like turquoise. Can anybody, can anybody see that? <laughs> I, I like... Uh, uh, turquoise just make me feel good, period. All right. Tinker's damn time. It's Tinker's damn time. Tinker's damn time. It's Tinker's damn time. Messages from your ancestors. Hey, hey, hey. All right. Blessings from the divine. That's what we're looking at tonight. Let's rock and roll with group number two. Group number two, my turquoise babies. Here we go. Here we go. Let's rock and roll. Hello, group number two. Going to play some Tinker's Dam, huh? Tinker's Dam, messages from the ancestors, blessings from the divine, whatever you want to call this. Playing with the Tinker's Dam, 156 cards. I do have some love cards here. We'll throw some love cards out as well with this spread. I got the uh, Mystic Moon Oracle. We'll see what that has to say. And I got a couple of couple of major arcanas from the Bowie. Let's rock and roll. Group number two. Group number two. My turquoise babies. Messages from the divine. What do we got right here? What do we got? Group number two. Here we go. Oh, oh. Wow, divine light. Divine light. You know, that's like uh, enlightenment, uh, maybe consciousness expansion, maybe third eye, throat chakra, heart chakra. Wow, look at that. That is the divine light. It says the source of all things. Well, you're definitely connected to the source of all things. In a, in a very strong way, and it does say enlightenment on there. Wow, powerful. Let's go, let's go for such a time as this. Divine Light, group number two, my turquoise babies. That's a power card right there for me. Here we go, here we go. What do you got to say? What do you got to say to your lovelies right here? Love team, there we go. What's that? Oh, the scales came out. Hey, this is a Libra card. Uh, there's Zodiac cards in this deck. Um, you may be a Libra, maybe you know a Libra. 
But what I see is this, you know, generally like when uh, the scales come out, it's like a justice card. Um, it says to me that if things are out of alignment, if things are out of balance, this card indicates uh, that uh, things are balancing out here for you. That's, a, that's like in the 3D, in the 3D world, things balancing out here for you. Divine Light and the Justice card or the Libra card has showed up around here. Let's go, let's go. Group 2, Group 2, Group 2, here we go. Messages from the Ancestors, what do we got? Ooh, ooh, look at what's balancing out around here. Honey, that looked like money. Honey, that looked like money. That is six pinnacles right there. Again, another uh, another card of balance. Got a lot of Libra energy with it. Ooh, six pinnacles. Six pinnacles and, uh, well, divine light. Look, <laughs> what is that? Is that a favor from the gods on your cash flow? Yeah, yeah, I take some of that. Or, you know, inspired ideas from the divine, you know, in regards to six pinnacles. <laughs> That's an entrepreneur card. This is an entrepreneur card for me. Uh, just great business uh, giftings. Really nice. Group number two. Get ready to go to the bank. <laughs> you know, this is, this is about getting some ideas from the heavenlies about making money, honey. Let's go, group two, group two. What do you want to say to him? Oh, oh, what's going on around here? It's a Leo card that just showed up. <laughs> That's a Leo card right there. Um, I just put on there the lion. It could be a lion heartedness right here. Oh no, what's this? It's the ace of cops. <laughs> oh, oh, we got an ace of cups around here. Well, it looks like somebody's love life could be balancing out along with their cash flow. That would be nice, huh? That would be nice. Yeah, the ace of cups, what's that say? Oh, the flood of emotions. Uh, and the gates of intuition. Oh, the flood of emotions. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> looks like, I don't know, it looks like somebody's having some kind of growth in their heart shocker around here. <laughs> yeah. Who the who? Who the who is somebody's heart chakras opening up? <laughs> here we go, here we go. All right, we'll put the divine light right here on this one that's having some kind of uh, heart chakra, heart chakra opening. Yeah, <laughs> it, it, that can be a little scary, you know, when that thing's been that thing's been hard as a rock forever. All of a sudden, they'll be like, oh, oh, Source, what are you doing? So this could be balancing out a story over here for somebody, right? Group number, I, I, I'm not sure if this is you, group number two. It might be a friend that you know. That might be a friend that you know right there. The gods are doing some heart surgery over here. Perfect, perfect. Let's go. Let's go. Because you got two balance cards over here. Things balancing out here for you. One of them seems to be money, honey. <laughs> we'll take that, man. We'll take that. If Source can get in there and open somebody's hearts up, we'll take a look at that too. Let's see what we got right here. What a fun spread. Oh my goodness. Yeah, group number two. The legend came out. The legend, let's put that right over there, right? Um, well, I mean, the legend's pretty self-explanatory. Um, I could say the gods feel that you're a legend. You know, you probably are. <laughs> Divine light, the legend. Somebody's heart chakra's opening over here, too. Well, well, the legend is going to the bank. <laughs> let's go, let's go. Give me something on this. Group two. Group two, Tinka's Dam. Tinka's Dam. Oh, Venus showed up. Oh, is Venus showed up again. <laughs> oh, we got love happening around here. We got love and money going on around here. Now we do. Venus showed up doing the love dance. 
You look amazing, darling. Look at this. Look at this story, right? <laughs> you go ahead and fill in the blanks on your own. Oh, Lordy. Oh, Lordy. So this is getting a hold of somebody's heart chakra in this story right here. This is uh, sensuality, immersion in the, in the beauty of this physical world and the senses. Look at that. Look at that, man. Oh, beautiful. A divine light shining on everybody. We got love and money on this red group, too. Yeah. This is, uh, this is like the angels, right? I mean, obviously. But they'd be, they'd be looking down from the heavenlies. They'd be looking down from the heavenlies on this story right here. What's this say? Oh, it's nice. It says, having access to... And knowledge of, oh, divine light, having access to and knowledge of the inner workings, the cogs, the gears, the flywheels of life, the universe, and all of its manifestations. Well, no wonder they call you the legend. No wonder they call you the legend. Look at that, man, divine light. Over here, we got six pins. We got things balancing out. Uh, we got somebody's heart chakra opening over here. But definitely look at the gods, looking at my legend right here. Yeah, man. And uh, giving more access to uh, the knowledge of the inner workings, the cogs, the gears, the flywheels of life. Super powerful. Let's go. Let's go. Give me another one right here. Group two, messages from the divine, messages from your ancestors. What do we got? Blessings from the gods. What do we got? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's a little teddy bear over here saying hi. Oh, look at that right there. Uh, let's put that let's put that right over here. See, this is my little teddy bear. What is this? This is the uh oh, it's the page. It's the page of pinnacles. It's the page of pinnacles. Love this deck. Hi, gorgeous. <laughs> hi. Hi, I wrote you a little Wrote you a little letter, <laughs> you know, because that's a communication card right there. That's a communication card. This is this is a fun story right there in its own, right? <laughs> Just these pictures are so fun, man. Look at this group, too. Look at this. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, hi. Oh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. And divine light over here. Look at this. Uh, the divine light and the celestial power. Uh Given, given, you know, given downloads or whatever to the legend. And, uh, you know, it could be about money, entrepreneurship, breakthrough, balance in your life. All right, that is absolutely beautiful. Let's pull a couple of uh, love cards on this. We got somebody's heart chakra opening. Here we go. Couple of love cards right here for group number two. Let's go. Let's go. Keep an open mind. <laughs> we got somebody opening their mind and their heart over here. Oh, oh, look at this love story. Oh, we got somebody opening their mind and opening their heart. Loud eh? Here we go. Here we go. What's this? Oh, it's a, it's, there's a forgiveness card here for somebody. There's a forgiveness card here. It does say healing family issues. That's a beautiful card. Give me one more right here. One more. One more. Attraction. Attraction. You know, that's about, for me, it's about let the past be in the past. Be in the now. Be in the moment. Don't put too much pressure on the future. Super nice, super nice. Let's see what Mystic Moon has to say right here, huh? Yeah, could could very well be a soggy, right? Could very well be self-forgiveness, self-love. Uh-huh. Here we go. Here we go. What do we got, love team? Group number two. Group number two. Messages from the divine. Here we go. Winter could be a seasonal card for somebody. Uh, where I live, where I live, it's the fall right now. So that's just a few short days away. 
Um, it could be about this right here, this love story, or it could be about breakthrough in the finances too. Anyway, it's a seasonal card. It's a seasonal card. It says winter. It says winter. Oh, <laughs> it's a love story around here. Look it, look it, look it. Recognition and the old empty chair over there. <laughs> Oh, recognition came out. Somebody's felt the coldness of their winter. I felt the coldness of my winter. <laughs> yeah, yeah, look at that. Oh. <laughs> hey, I'm digging this, man. Venus showing up around here. Okay, okay. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Give me another mystic moon. Another mystic moon. What we got? <laughs> it matches. It matches this right here. Oh lordy, oh lordy, what's happening to me? Heart chakra, heart chakra's opening. Oh lordy, oh lord, what? I'm thinking differently. Oh my goodness, man. Woo! Somebody's having a full blown awakening right here. Heart chakra, consciousness expansion. I see you over here just getting downloads from the gods about you know. Bank. <laughs> what a fun story right here. All right, all right. We're all right. Give me one more. Give me one more. Give me one more. Then we'll pull a couple majors on here. Messages from source. Messages from the gods. Blessings from the divine. I oh, see. Purge. Purge. It's right here, man. Listen, if you've been believing for somebody, it doesn't have to be a lover. Could be whoever you've been praying for, whoever you've been believing for, they are having a major move in their life. Consciously, the heart chakra, and the, you know, I mean, it looks to me like uh, the gods are blessing you. Huh? Probably because all the love and energy you put out. This is like a, a divine reward, anyway, for you. Number two. Oh, see, look at that. The balancing in the scales right there. The balancing in the scales. Again, justice and six pins three times, man. Three times justice has come out on this spread for group number two. Very beautiful. Very beautiful. All right. Give me a major arcana on this for group number two. Messages from the divine. Blessings from the ancestors. Major, please. Major. Oh, the magician showed up. I told you, group number two, nothing just happens. The magician knows that. The magician is my deliberate creator. Uh, they, they, they think pure positive as best they can. I mean, look at him. His head's all lit up right there. They speak positive words over their life, over their future, over other people. Uh, and they, they have inspired action. They just don't sit on the couch. When the divine say, get up and get up and put some action, the, the magician will get up and put action behind. Very nice. Very nice. Group number two. The deliberate creator, the manifester. Give me one more right here. Group number two. Group number two. Group number two. And temperance. I'm going to put this right over here on your friend. Could be a lover. Could be, a, you know, a family member. Whoever. Whoever you've been, you've been lifting up. Somebody's been lifting this person up right here. And temperance showed up on it. So it could be. Could be your lover, huh? Those are my two soulmates right there. That's Michael. That's Michael, the archangel. And this is very, very powerful energy about uh, co-creative energy with the divine. See, the heavenlies, as, a, as above, so below. Well, there's the above, and there's the one on earth right there. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful energy. Reconciliation, manifestation, uh, the purging. <laughs> anyway, group number two. What a powerful, powerful spread. May all your dreams come true, my friends. I'll pull some cards for you in a few short days. Love and light. Bye for now. Powerful, powerful reads tonight. Thank you, Source. Let's do it one more time. 
Group number three, my crystal babies. Group number three. Fun, 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 man. Fun, fun, fun. All right. All right. And I got somebody that hollered at me. Let me see who hollered at me right there. Hey, Capricorn Soul Tribe, nice to see you tonight. Hi, Sherry, nice to see you tonight. It's all good, it's all good, mermaid. Love and light. Oh, okay. Oh, it's Jesse Bear. Hi, Jesse. Nice to see you tonight. Wonderful, my friend. Level two read for you tonight. Looking forward to it, Jesse. Thanks for hitting that button one more time. Oh, you leveled up. Wow, thank you. Anyway, anyway, thank you. Level two reading for you. Jesse Bear. Thank you, my friend. Looking forward to it. All right, let's do group three. Let's do group three. Let's do group three. love in the house tonight you guys have an amazing energy thank you for sharing it with me and everybody in the house tinker's damn time is tinker's damn time is tinker's damn time messages from the divine <laughs> here we go here we go yeah 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 group number three group number three let's see what the gods have to say Source, your ancestors, the universe. All right. All right. I'm ready. I'm ready. Hello, group number three. Gonna play some tarot with you, huh? Tinka's damn style, 156 cards right here. Messages from your ancestors, huh? Uh, blessings from the gods. Let's see what they got. Let's see what they see what their plans are, huh? <laughs> Let's see what they've been thinking about when it comes to you. Uh, gonna throw some love cards. Gonna throw some Mystic Moon Oracle on it. And going to throw a couple of Major Arcana from the Starman. All that being said, group number three, messages. What's that? What's that? What's that? Oh, oh, this is a faith card right here. This is a faith card. It's about innocence of heart. They be talking to Source right there. And look at what's here. The griffin's here. Now, <laughs> now the griffin, <laughs> the griffin is like a card of divine protection. We can go with that right here. Keeper of the timelines. I put that with the griffin. It's like an, it's an ancestor card for me. He's the griffin. Um, divine protection. Look at this right here. Look at this. Group three. Says you've been talking to Source. You know, may have been some things out of alignment when the Griffin shows up, right? Because he's the keeper of the timeline. So he comes back in here to help you get back on track. And um, uh, brings in strength. Brings in courage. Brings in uh, guidance. Brings in uh, divine protection. And also... Now, the griffin can be a punisher if, if, if that is needed in this situation. 
We'll let the griffin figure that out. But this is the griffin coming in here, group number three, to take care of some business, get you back on track, get you back where you're supposed to be going around here. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful opening. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Group number three, the griffin showed up. Perfect, perfect. Here we go. What's going on? Group number three. Oh, look at it again, man. This faith card came out. Yeah, this is more of kind of like a hoping and a praying. And the griffin showed up. The griffin has showed up. Uh, divine protection. Look at this. Confidence and conviction. Especially a belief in the powers that are larger than oneself. Wow. Uh, surrendering to something larger than yourself. Perfect. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Yes. Yes. Confidence and conviction, especially in a belief in the powers that are larger than oneself. Well, that's what the Griffin's about right there. To show you, show you, show you that the gods got your back. Really nice stuff right here. Group number three. Here we go. Here we go. Give me some on this. That's the blessing right there. Here we go. Group number three. Group number three. Group number three. Here we go. What's this? Oh. This is the Ace of Water. Um, it's the, uh, it's, 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 well, look at this. Whatever, whatever was blocking, like, a love energy. The griffin come in here taking care of all that. That's what it says, because this is like an ace of cups. You know, it's, it's you know, what we hang on to when we're in the ocean of emotion right there, right? Um, uh, so it says relationships and love. Perfect. Look at this. Look at this faith. Faith right here. And the griffin coming in here taking care of a whole bunch of business over here. It's like whatever was trying to stop this energy. Everyone's trying to stop this energy. That has been stopped. Give me more on this, too. Give me more on this for group three. Group three. Messages from the divine. What's that? Oh, this is a, this is a beautiful card right here. Here it's two of feathers or two of swords. Um, it has a different meaning. I gave this a different meaning. You know, I gave all these my own meanings. This says, from darkness, aspiring to light. This is what I'm looking at right here. Darkness, aspiring to light. From conflict to balance. This is beautiful, man. The truth is within. Wow. Two of feathers. Two of swords. Uh, to me, this is from darkness, aspiring to light. From conflict, aspiring to balance. Perfect, man. Let's go. Group three. Group three. This is like prayers being answered around here. Whatever was stopping that love energy, man, that has changed. The griffin's taking care of all that. Whatever that was over there, man. Here we go. Here we go. Group three. I'm excited for you. Group three. Group three. Group three. What we got? Group three. Oh, hey man, this is this is the this is the King of Pentacles just showed up around here. Well, you know, kind of an interesting hat. <laughs> yeah, yeah, kind of a horny little hat, right there. The, the King of the World just showed up. King, King, King of the World showed up around here. Oh, lordy. Okay, man, it's a King of Pentacles, you know, for me. High vibration, King of Pentacles is somebody loving, generous, kind, giving, you know. Uh, they, they, they know how to make the coin. You know, they live, in, they live in the Ten of Pentacles palace. You know, it's the king of the world. Group number two. You had the king, or I know I got fellows watching, or the queen of the world has showed up here. Whatever the griffin's doing, man. The Griffin's clearing some energy over here. I like this for you, man. Give me more. Give me more. Group three. Group three. Give me more. What do we got? Group three. What is that right there? 
Oh, this is a card of beginnings and endings. Look at the crown right there. Somebody grab that crown and put it on. There's a new beginning. Oh, a beginning and an ending. There is an ending right here. Griffin's going to make sure whatever that was about. That Griffin is ending that. So this new beginning can come out right here. This is absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> All right, we got endings. We got beginnings. Look at this. This is the Empress. Yay. Venus, a major arcana. Venus. What's this right here? Oh, 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 oh. oh this is Ten Pinnacles right here. Somebody. Somebody. We got Ten Pinnacles right here, right? That's the, uh, well, it says Legacy, man. I told you it's the King of the World right there. It's the King of the World and the Empress. <laughs> What a nice story for somebody. What a nice story for somebody. Thank thank you, Griffin. Thank you for handling all that. And, you know, this is where these two hang out. They hang out in that beautiful world of Ten Pinnacles, right? What a nice story for somebody right here. Again, two of swords from darkness aspiring to light, from conflict aspiring to balance. Really nice, man. Ace of Cups. Faith. Really nice. All right. Well, that's beautiful, man. Let's go. Let's go. Let's throw a couple of love cards on here. Why not, man? What a beautiful love story right here, huh? Let's go. Let's go. A couple of love cards on here. Group three. Group three. Thank you, Source. Thank you, Griffin. Here we go. Here we go. What we got, right? Oh, they have chemistry. Well, I would say. I would say with the king of the world and the empress and ten pins. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh la la. <laughs> Ooh la. What's that? Is that the star? Yes. Yes, that's the star in their hand right there. Beautiful. Group three. Beautiful, my friend. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Yeah, let's go. And look at finances and career. I told you, man, look at all these pinnacles on this spread right here. You know, and the Empress ain't broke, you know. The Empress, she's not broke, man, and the Emperor, king of the world ain't broke. Finances and career. Look, looks like you've been sowing your seeds for a while. See, that's what I see with that picture. You've been sowing seeds in your garden of love, and your garden of life for a while. This is a breakthrough right here, beginnings and endings. So powerful. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Give me one more love card on this, please. Attraction. So nice. All three of my reads got this card tonight, right? That's the old law of attraction. You know, it's a, it's a card about let past energies be in the past. Be in your now. Be in your moment. Be in your soul, right? Don't put too much pressure on the future. This is a beautiful story of a... Well, it's a power couple, ain't it? It's a power couple. Playfulness. Playfulness came out. What a nice... What a, what a nice, nice spread. All right. Couple of majors, huh? Oh, no. We are, we are to Mystic Moon. Get a couple of Mystic Moon on here, please. Couple of Mystic Moon right here. Couple of Mystic Moon. Mm. That says grief. It's like these days are over. If this is who this is right here. See, because the griffin came here. The griffin showed up. It's like these days are over, okay? Here we go, here we go. Give me more on this, please. Give me more on this. Give me more on this. That's what I'm getting out of it. See, because this is a faith card. This is a shifting of energy right here. It's like these days are gone. I'm telling you, thank you, Griffin. I'm telling you, whoever I'm reading for right here, the gods have intervened right here. Now look what happened. Now look what happened. Ooh, look at the cards. Um, commitment came out. Let's put that over here by the Empress and that King of Pins 
endings. Yes, definitely endings to all that sadness. And commitment, Ten of Pentacles, the king of the world, and the empress, Ten of Pentacles, commitment. Oh, look at, look, look at your cards. Devotion. And ascension. Yes, yes. Wow, so nice, yeah, so nice, wow. Huh? Metamorphosis. Metamorphosis. Wow. All right. Now let's pull a couple of majors on here, my lovelies. Power, 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 man. Yeah. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. These days are over right here. Whatever. Whatever went down, man. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, the chariot came out. Ah. Oh. Big cancer showing up around here. Um, now the chariot card, it, it, it's on the tree of life in the position where it runs the messages from the gods to the people, from the people to the gods about love. And this is forward movement and the chariot talks about leaving past energies in the past and moving forward in this very beautiful uh, direction right here. It, the chariot is a card of victory for me. Here we go. One more. Group three. What breakthrough? Breakthrough right here. Breakthrough. Let's go. Let's go. One more. Group three. What do we got? Oh, it's Michael. It's Temperance. <laughs> it's the angel of the middle way showing up here. They have a couple of soulmates in their hand. Um, can be a can be a reconciliation card for some of you. I don't know. Definitely a beautiful, beautiful love story. Beautiful, beautiful love story. And uh, letting these days, letting these days go. Letting these days go. I'm going to put that ending. I'm going to put that ending right on that card right there. And a new beginning uh, for my group number three. Oh, damn. There's a hair fan right there. Home now, home now, home now. Hair fan wanted to say hi to you. <laughs> hair fan wanted to say hi. Group number three. Hope you enjoyed this spread. I definitely enjoyed reading for you, my friends. May all your dreams come true. I'll pull you some cards in a few short days. Love and light. Bye for now. Wow, those are fun. I like those ancestor readings.